Is this a bored child or a threat to public safety? Someone who saw him pacing around a Cleveland park was worried enough to call the police. The guy keeps pulling it in our It's probably fake, but you know what? It's scaring the A patrol car arrives at the scene, and seconds later... Shots fired. Mail down. Um, black mail. Maybe 20. Um, black revolver, black handgun. Tamir Rice, who was 12 years old, died later in hospital. His family wanted these recordings released, and the police obliged. This is not an effort to exonerate. It's not an effort to uh, show the public that anybody did anything wrong. Police say Tamir was told three times to raise his hands, but his family questions the speed of the incident. It is our belief that this situation could have been avoided and that Tamir should still be here with us. The video shows one thing distinctly. The police officers reacted quickly. This comes at a time when the country is at boiling point over the treatment of young African Americans by white police. People are furious at the grand jury decision not to prosecute a white police officer who kills Michael Brown. Since his death in August, more than a dozen teenagers have been killed by police. Half were African Americans, many carrying pellet guns, like Tamir's. Laura Westbrook, BBC News.